In this video, we're gonna cover candidate tracking and reporting and how to track the ROI of your campaigns right within Boost Point. So first of all, we're gonna jump right in here to our main dashboard. And what you can do here, you can go and choose the time period of what you want to report. So for this example, this is just some sample data right here. I'm gonna go back a couple months and then right here I can see all of the candidates that applied within this time period and what stage that they're currently in or the status of the applicant or candidate. Um, and I can see a nice graph and report like this just to be able to see how successful you know, we've been with, um, with attracting candidates and hiring uh, employees for our business. So kind of stepping back, like a, a benchmark that you'll want to set, and this is what we see kind of average across the US and Canada is a one out of 10 higher rate. Again, some, some locations you can get a little bit better than that, some uh, you know a little under that, but benchmark as a whole, that's what we're seeing as average. So example for you know out of every 10 contacts and applicants applying for a position, you know, if you're qualifying the applicants properly, your goal should be to hire one of those. So 10% higher rate. Um, and we'll dig into kind of the follow-up process of you know, how to get uh, those type of numbers from applicants coming within Boost Point. But right here, I wanna just show how you can track that properly. So this is what a report can look like within the Boost Point dashboard. As far as being able to generate a report like that, a report like that it's all about keeping track of the statuses of your applicants. So I'm gonna jump in here to my contacts page. I'm gonna pull up a candidate and we'll see where we can track these statuses. So um, right down here within the contact info, <clears throat> you can scroll down and see the contact status. So this is a, a new lead. So if we've maybe completed an interview with this candidate, we can put that candidate in as interview complete. And then when I go back to my dashboard, <clears throat> I'll be able to see that there's gonna be one more individual within that stage. So I'm just gonna select my time period again here. Then I go to the contact status report here and I see there's one more in interview complete. So this is where you'll easily be able to see your success rate and your hire rate from Boost Point applicants.